used. Uh, as, you can, as you know, I can't really afford much right now, so yes, I'm, pull, I'm pulling out. Which it means. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the show. My name is Ness, and today the Rustin has come out. That is the hijacked Rustin. Rustin hijacked? I don't know. Something like that. Anyways, we will take a look at it and take a look at the price. I did order it already. So what we're going to do is take a look at it. First of all, you see the price right here, $430,000. That's not bad. I hope it's worth it, but it's not bad. I like it. I do like the design and looks of this car so far from what I've seen. Um, we're going to get more into that here in just a moment. I'll probably do a quick kind of thing. Uh, and then we'll do a meetup with Maniacal and see the comparisons of what we've done. So yeah, we're going to jump into the car right now, or, and we will check out everything that we can. I ordered in blue. It came in blue and black. I like it. I like it. This is the Rustin. I already love it. It's awesome. Not very much in the protection aspect, but hey, I like it. We're going to just head to the shop inside of our office here. And I think I'm going to do a quick thing. I'm not going to waste you guys' time going over everything. So let's go ahead and get into this. Alright, that looks like that's going to be our car right there. I do say I am liking it. I'm liking it. I thought about going with a dark color on this, but because of how the rims are with this, if you do the uh, stock rim option, uh, you can actually multicolor your rims pretty nicely. So I went with the ultra blue with my crew color. And uh, right now, I'm going to give it a test run. And then uh, later on, we'll meet up with Maniacal and see what he's done to his car. Okay, so. And I like the stock option on a lot of the stuff on this car, like the bumpers and stuff like that. Um, so I just left it as is. Didn't really see a reason to change it. I, I, I rather like them. Excuse me, what are you doing, bro? Oh, 
I can burn him. You... Fine. Let's do this. Come on. And there's an insurgent. Gotta go. Car feels a little heavy. It's really grippy and sticky though, so I like it. But at the same time, it's like, uh... and there went my tire. Son of a bitch. Which means I'm gonna die. I hate perks like that, guys. If you're in a game like this, you know a DLC just came out. Please don't be that guy. Especially if you're an insurgent. I mean, come on. Now I gotta make it to the shop on flats. I knew it. See, this is why I get bulletproof tires, which means I can't have any fun with the whole drift aspect of thing, which I love drifting. Oh my god. Yeah, so this is our car. I didn't put a roll cage on it because I like how it looks. It's got that nice sporty kind of look to it. Get it to where the sun can hit these rims. There we go. Yeah, that's our car. I like it. Yes. As, you can, as you know, I can't really afford much right now. So yes, I'm, pull I'm pulling out. <laughs> Other than, alright, we're finally meeting up with Maniacal for our... Okay, yeah, sure. You want to pull out there, or do you want to do, like, a half in the shade, half not in the shade? I'm going to park in the most beautiful spot possible. I'm going to get that whole color change effect on my car. I'm going to go half in the shade, half not. If the shade will quit moving! Okay, so quickly. That's with the shade, that's without the shade. Okay, there we go. Screw you, son! Oh, that is pretty. I see what you're talking about now. Oh. Anyways. Ha! Ah, got out at the same time. That was awesome. So, like I was saying, now we're meeting up with Maniacal here. Checking out the new Rustins. He went with yeah. his usual theme. I went with my usual theme here. And I see that you actually made some changes to your car. New front bumper there, correct? Yeah, a little bit of a new bumper. Uh huh. They different. Let me not have the uh, little spoiler in the bottom here. It's a uh, the splitter. Splitter. There you go. Mm. You went with the roll cage. Okay. Cool deal. Cool deal. Yep. I thought yep. about it, but I was like, you know what? It reminded me too much of the Bifta. If I wanted to drive something small and sporty like that, I'd grab my Bifta. I like the uniqueness of it not having anything on it and it just being like a sleek, sporty look. You know. Yeah. Well, my thought process is I'm going to be driving this thing. It looks like a go-kart. I'm probably going to be doing all kinds of jumps. So mm, true. if I land on my head, I, I don't want to land on my head. <laughs> Let's see. So, what do you got going on back here? That's that different. Is not quite the, the GT wing, but it's the one that has the little, little doohickeys on the side here. Yeah, the, it's the same wing that I got, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's very nice. And then yep. you got the different rear bumper, it looks like. Uh, Which yeah, I'm kind of, I, I am kind of digging that. That's pretty sick. I liked I it the like. best out of all of them. Yeah. I think I was gonna go with that, but I ended up not. I ended up just sticking with the stock because of the multicolor look. Yeah. I just Which like the pipe on the bottom. Yeah, that's, that's the reason why I was thinking too. I was like, I like it because of that. Like you're saying, it has a whole goat card effect to it. Mm. You went with the same hood as me. Cool deal. Cool deal. I like it. Yep. I like it. I think we went with the same uh, spoiler on the side. Yeah, same uh, uh, side skirts. Yeah. So me, like, I looked through a lot of the options. I honestly didn't change much. I, I put the splitter on the bottom there. Because I liked the splitter. I didn't change the front bumper. I didn't change the back bumper. Because I liked the way the bo both of them looked. Um, same wing as you, and our cars are filling up with water. <laughs> 
Uh, same hood as you. Now Here's with me, question. huh? Here's a good question. Hmm. What happened? Bulletproof. My tires? Okay. Yeah. Are they? I think. I don't think they are. Nope. Oh, nope, nope, they're not. Because I want to stance my car and everything like that for some drift action later on. Oh, okay. um, uh... Those are the stock rims. I decided to go ahead and do the uh, do the uh, color glitch through the uh, app the app on the phone, the iFruit app. Um, that way they're multicolored, purple and blue. That's not the kind of drifting I meant, but okay. You know what? Shoot. Let me go into first person here. I think that we just... Okay. That's... Look how destroyed the rim got. Yeah. It took away the outer purple ring and, like, totally destroyed... That is gnarly. Anyway, so yeah. You went with your teal and race yellow, I'm guessing. Yeah, it's a uh, midnight blue with midnight a blue. race yellow... Uh pearl accent. I did that little glitch. Yeah. And then a normal yellow uh, overlay. Or a secondary color. Secondary, sorry. yeah. Yeah. Um, Honestly, gonna... I, yeah, go for it. Mine is just the crew color with an ultra blue secondary. And that is going to be that. We will probably mess around with these, but that's going to be for another video. You'll see them in races. We'll give you our performance tests and stuff then. So if you did, did enjoy, make sure you guys smack that like button, leave a comment down below, and subscribe to stay tuned for more fun. Till next time, guys. Peace. Bye bye. Like a hell cut. <laughs>